Hello everybody and welcome back to the Final Fantasy X. Uh, I had a little bit of a boo-boo and lost some footage so I'm gonna have to explain expressly what happened on a pause menu so we aren't hearing the background of the uh, thing. So, like my, my previous intro I was like, hey what's up? <laughs> we left off doing some stuff on the Albed ship. Uh really sucks. It was unlike like losing all your footage by your capture software messing up. I lost all my footage due to human error. Mainly I pressed the wrong button at the wrong time. This game's not letting me pause. I want to pause so I can uh No, no, no. I'm I'm going to let the cutscenes play and I'll talk on my way to the place while doing random encounters. Sounds cool? Cool. Alrighties. Uh, very quickly, I'm gonna go over here and grab a Magoozleboo. <laughs> it's a crest you get, like, way later, way later in the game for an ultimate weapon. But yeah, I'm, I'm really upset. I lost a good, like, half an hour of... I said a few funny jokes, right? There were, like, two jokes in that half an hour, so about a joke every 15 minutes. Uh, hopefully I'll make up for that by doing more quality puns here, like Waka has orange hair and the uh, Titus. Haha. <laughs> Yo. Hiya. Hey. You wanna try that move one more time? Finally. Things were starting to look up. You know amateur. Who you play for? The Xanarkin Abes. Okay. I'm gonna have to pause here and say some things. So on the Albat salvage ship, after you dive into the water, the inky goopy blackness, uh, with Riku, you salvage an old airship for the Albed. I made the joke, the Albed salvage wreckages like the Amish build barns. Haha, <laughs> it was funny. But uh, when you get back on the deck, Riku and Titus are talking, and she's like, Hey, where are you from? Oh, I'm from Xenarkand. And Riku drops the bombshell saying, uh, Xanarkand was destroyed, like, a thousand years ago. And then, uh, she proceeds to tell him about the toxin of sin, meaning, like, it can make people's minds go all fuzzy and possibly make them forget things. We know that Titus isn't a fuzzy, and he remembers the things. So, let's continue. What team you say again? Uh... I meant, forget that. Uh, I got too, uh, close to sin, and my head's all foggy-like. So, uh, I don't know where this place is. Or even where I came from. Sin's toxin got to you. But you're still alive. Praise be to heaven. Now, okay, sorry, I gotta pause again. I really hate dumping exposition on you guys. Yevon is, like, the world religion? But it's also more government than religion, which there are some, like, deep, meaningful things that happen soon and later that will be explained more. Alright, back to practice. I'm Waka, coach and captain of the Besaid Oryx, brother. <laughs> what, you hungry? Okay, back to the village. I'll get you something. 
One of my favorite bits of dialogue is coming up like right up here when I talk to uh, my Waka boy. My boy. I felt like I could trust this Waka, so I just had to ask. Um, uh, it's true Xanarkin was destroyed, right? A thousand years ago? So it's just a big pile of rubble now, isn't it? Long time ago, there were a whole lot of cities in Spira. Big cities with machina, machines to run them. People played all day and let the machina do the work. And then, well, take a look. Sin came and destroyed the machina cities. And Xanarkand along with him. Yeah, that was about a thousand years ago. Just like you said. If you ask me, sin's our punishment for letting things get out of hand. What gets me though, is we gotta suffer because of what some goofballs did way back when. Of course, we must always repent for our sins. That's important. It's just that it's hard to keep at it sometimes, you know? It was just as Riku said. Waka and Riku couldn't both be lying. Why would they? <laughs> but you from the Xanarkand Daves, that was a good one, huh? Hey, I'm not saying that team never existed, yeah? <laughs> but you gotta figure, a team living in luxury like that be pretty soft, eh? I appreciated the fact that Waka was trying to cheer me up. But at that time, all I could think about was... Everything that happened to me, all this, started with sin. Maybe if I could find Sin one more time, I could go home. For now, I'd just live life until that time came. No more worrying about where or when I was. Sure, it was hard not to think of home, but I started to feel better already. A little better. Maybe. So, uh, right about here is where I was going to end that last video because, you know. But... I really like the deeper themes that this story plays out. So, Sin is both a physical embodiment of death and destruction, as we've seen, the big death whale that destroyed Xenarkand, but Sin is also in the context of sin, as in, you know, morally wrong and doing things. So sin is our punishment for letting things get out of hand, like Waka said. So there's, like, deep-rooted meaning in some of these things that go on. Hey, it's this way. Anyway. Oh, well, hang on. There's a little bit that happens after this. Then I'll talk about what actually happened. Like why Titus is here in junk. Also, look how pretty it is! Alrighty, so, uh, what happened on the ship? I told you the exposition bit about the Albed doing stuff and being Amish for the scrapping. But, um, after Riku and Titus talked for a bit, uh, Sin attacked the Albed scrapper ship. And that's why Titus is now on Besaid, because he washed up here. Alright, I need I need to get in the mindset. I need to need to say the words like I'm funny. LOL JK XD. Is that doing it for you? Am I a pro pro YouTuber yet? Like while while I'm swimming around, I know there's gonna be random encounters and stuff, and I do want to fill the dead air of me not talking because you know, it's kind, it's kind of boring otherwise, but just take in the environment, like listen to the music and see how pretty everything is. When I was younger, I was never able to, uh, like really grasp what was going on, and this HD remaster is just beautiful. Especially the arranged soundtrack going along with it. And there's even more destroyed city bits. <sighs> Okay, random encounter. 
Bud. I want to ask you something. Stop. That's gonna happen a lot. I'm gonna be in the middle of gushing about how pretty the game is and how much I love it, and then a random encounter is just gonna poop in my soup. Anyway. So there's even more bits of ruined city here in the water. Like, I wouldn't say it's been reclaimed by nature entirely, but hey, it. it Looks nice, I guess. Waka and his pedo laugh. Heh heh heh. Heh Got a favor to ask you. You want me on your team, right? Oh, I thought you wanted me to do something else. Okay. A major blitz tournament's coming up. All the teams in Spira will be there. It's so huge, I'm sure someone there will recognize you. Then, you can go back to your old team, right? It'll be fun. What do you say, huh? Come on, come on! Sure thing. Oh, crap. Okay. So here's the dealio. Uh, my grandmother just got home, meaning I don't want to record with her in the background and me talking in the dogs. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to get to the next save point, but I'm going to unplug my mic. So that, that, that's that. So just enjoy the game. You can stop watching here if you don't want to watch me just run around. Um, bye, I guess. And we're the only two... I wasn't too far off either. This is where I was born. I started Blitz when I was five. I joined the Aurochs at 13, 10 years ago. 10 years, and we never won a game. Well, after last year's tournament, I quit. Time seemed right. So, after quitting, I got this new job, yeah? But every time my mind wandered, I thought about the game. Ten years without a single win will do that. Mm. My first match last year was my big chance. But something else was on my mind. I couldn't focus. Nice excuse. Hey, hey! So, you want to win the next tournament? Go out with a bang. So, what's our goal? I don't care how we do. As long as we play our best. If we give it our all, I can walk away happy. Uh, no, 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 no. If I say, what's our goal? You say, victory! When you play in a Blitzball tournament, you play to win. Victory? You're serious? Ah, the one from the sea. Be on guard. There are fiends on the road today. After surviving your run-in with Sin, it would be a shame if something happened now. Who are they? Luzu and Gata, Crusaders. Huh? Crews of what? What, you forgot that too? Hey, sorry. Don't worry about it. I'll help you out. Cool. In return, come tournament time, I'll make sure we take the cup. Cool. About the Crusaders, you can ask them yourself. They got a lodge in a village. He saved village. They got any food there? We'll get you something over there later. Take a look around first. Let's see. 
The Crusaders' lodge is over yonder. Luzu and Gata are usually there. Hmm. All right. Over here. Huh? What's up? You do remember the prayer, right? I didn't know it in the first place, to tell the truth. Man, that's like the basics of the basics. All right, I'll show you. Go ahead, you try. Hmm. Hmm. Present yourself to the temple summoner. Any Blitzball player would know that prayer. It was the Blitzball sign for victory. <laughs> 